Yeah. Happy June, everybody. Now, this is not a sad song. However, the story behind it is uh, back in 1970, there was a guitar player named Maury Mulison. And one day, Maury was uh, dropping a friend off at the train station in Trenton, New Jersey. And as he was doing so, he happened to run into a girl that he went to high school with who was dropping a friend off at the train station. Uh, her name was Mary, and they talked, and uh, she was all dolled up because she had become a fashion model. And of course, Maury was a guitar player in 1970, so he looked like a schlump. So there, there's quite a contrast there. So this little uh, encounter inspired him to write a song for her that he wanted to play for her someday and surprise her with it. Uh, unfortunately, Maury never got a chance to surprise her with the song because he was in the plane with Jim Croce when it went down. He was Jim Croce's lead guitar player. Fortunately, however, they did record the song during their last uh, session in September of 1973, and they finished the record eight days before the plane crash. So fortunately, Mary did get to hear the song. Uh, unfortunately, it wasn't a live thing. And uh, re remembering their contrasting appearances, that inspired the song's title. Anybody know which song we're talking about? 1973, Jim Croce. Leroy Madness. Yes. Okay, this is Salon and Saloon. Salon and Saloon. Okay. I have to move a little bit. Hang on a second. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sometimes I think about our good old high school days.